Hey there, Tony here. And as promised, I am here to give you the no spoiler review of the movie Yesterday. Now, um, for those of you who don't know, the movie Yesterday is all about this guy who finds himself in a world where the Beatles, as well as some other things, don't exist. Okay? And he's a musician and uh, he then goes forward in the world and pretty much takes the music of the Beatles and shares it with the world. Now, before I go into this movie review, let me first preface it by saying I'm a big Beatles music fan. Uh, I think their music is incredible. And I've seen a number of other videos or movies featuring the Beatles music. You know, things like uh, Sgt. Pepper's Lonely Hearts Club Band or um, uh, Over the Universe. Um, both those movies, oh, I'm sorry, Across the Universe. And in both those movies, uh, they didn't do well at the box office. Sometimes they were critically panned. But I enjoyed those movies because of the music. And what I'll say about yesterday, without giving any spoilers away, is that yesterday is an okay movie. Um, it's kind of a, like a roller coaster because uh, whenever you hear the Beatles music and you hear somebody on there who is uh, sharing the Beatles music, it's like this great, great um, crescendo, if you will, in excitement. And then when they stop sharing the Beatles music and they're going into the plot of the story, it becomes less uh, less great. So it's like a roller coaster. The story's okay, but it's just the fun of hearing those Beatle music, the Beatles songs uh, being covered by this guy using, of course, the newest technology and so forth. There's a couple of surprise uh, appearances by people in the movie that I will not give away because it adds to the couple of wows that I got watching the movie. So here's what I'll tell you. If you're someone who likes the Beatles music like I will, like I do, you will enjoy this movie and I encourage you to check it out. Now, if you're someone who thinks the Beatles are like, eh, well, you might find the movie to be a little bit of an eh. So, that is the movie review. No spoilers. I hope you, I hope that you find it helpful. You know, people have been after me to get these movie reviews back out again. And I said, you know what, I'm going to go ahead and get started. And some people were kind of upset because I didn't do it with Avengers Endgame. Well, the good news is Avengers Endgame is going to be uh, re-released here this weekend. So I will go to that and I will uh, let you know because everyone's probably already seen the movie. It's one of the highest grossing movies of all time. But I will let you know if it's worth it to go see it again with the new stuff they're adding for the re-release. So, with all that being said, I want to make an offer to you. One of the things that happens at the Cineplex is that they have so many different movies, it's hard to know what to see when you go to the movies. So, if you send me an inbox, a private message, I will give you the top five, in my opinion, movies that are out right now at the general movie Cineplex, if you will. But not the second run stuff, but the stuff at the first run theaters. I'll give you my top five. So again, private message only. Send me a private message. I will get that to you. And um, I think that's it. So anyway, have a great rest of the day. Yesterday, like I said, okay movie. I don't have a rating system. I should probably come up with something like a two thumbs up or three apples or something. But I'd say, again, if you like the Beatles music, check it out. If you're not a Beatles fan, you may pass on this one. Uh, as far as the credits, there's nothing after the credits, but of course, over the credits, you do hear Beatles music. So anyway, have a great day, and I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye now.